Hello, this is Cute Fuzzy Weasel, or rather Cute Fuzzy Weasel's hands. Today uh, we'll be doing Shadow Dragon 23 suggestion of a cat riding an ox with a chainsaw. Now, I asked them uh, whether or not the cat had a chainsaw or the ox had a chainsaw, and uh, they said the cat had a chainsaw, so the cat's gonna be carrying a chainsaw. And if you'd like to skip ahead to the video where I put all this together in a time lapse and just play it at the end for like 10 seconds, go ahead and click there. Okay, let's go ahead and get this started. So, hmm, a cat riding an ox. I don't know, how in the fuck do you start something like that? I guess, uh, I guess I gotta get an idea of what the ox is doing. So this could be like the ox head. Yeah, this is the ox head. Now, I did look up a picture of an ox, and they have huge fucking horns. So I'm gonna make, I'm gonna give this thing really big horns. Yeah, so the horn's gonna be like right there, and right there, yeah, okay. Uh, and, you know, I'm gonna have the eye here, and I'm gonna have the eye here. Kind of, kind of a, a, a derp ox. Okay, you know what, they never, they never, uh, Shadow Wolf, uh, Wolf, Shadow Wolf, Shadow Wolf, you never specified whether or not the ox had problems. So, there, the ox is gonna have its tongue out. And it's kind of cow nose is going to be all like that. All right. And let's see. The neck's going to come down here. So the body is going to be sort of off in this direction. <coughs> yeah, yeah, that, that'll be good. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And then those will be the, the legs, and here will be the back legs of the ox. Yeah, kind of going up like that, and kind of in there. All right, and then the ox tail is going to be there. Uh, so now the cat... Um, cat's gonna be holding a chainsaw, but, you know, it said, you said riding an ox. You said riding an ox, but you never said anything about it being, um, actually on the ox's back, so I'm gonna have the cat kind of swinging from the ox's horn. <laughs> yeah, that'll be the, um... Yeah, the, the, the cat will be, uh, you know what, instead of it being right there, let's have the cat be right here. So the cat will be swinging from the ox's horn, which is kind of like riding. I mean, the Plains Indians would straddle the sides of the horse, like, and, and kind of do this thing where they, they would ride on the side and use the horse as uh, almost like cover. I think that's how it worked. So it's not unreasonable that a cat could ride an ox like that. And if it is, then I, I resign. <laughs> I resign. And those are the cat paws, its back legs, and its tails kind of kind of curling in. Yeah, because when you pick up a cat by like the scruff of the neck, the tail kind of curls between the legs, so it's going to be like that. The tail's going to be coming out like that. And then this hand here, this paw here, is going to be out kind of like this. <laughs> and it's going to be holding the business. It's not going to be holding the chain. It's going to be holding the handle to the chain saw, which will be coming out like 
this. Yeah, there we go. Okay. All right, so let's grab this. All right, so that's the very basic line art of what this is. This this crazy thing is gonna be. <clears throat> All right, now a cat face. I think the cat would be probably screaming. Or, you know what? Instead of screaming, cat's going to be playing it totally cool. Yeah, because the cat knew this was going to happen from the start. I mean, he kind of understood that this was going to be kind of a rough day. But he knew. He had an idea. He had an idea of what was going to go on. So he's... He's he's hanging on the he's hanging on the on the ox's horn and he's wearing sunglasses and he's playing this shit totally cool. Just totally cool. Yeah. Yeah, he's cool cat. No, I'm kidding. He's not a cool cat. This thing could whoop could could whoop cool cat's ass. Yeah. Alright chest um, arm coming up here and there's the ox's horn and it's the I'm, I'm playing kind of fast and loose with the uh, proportions here foreshortening not being a strong suit of mine uh, so the cat's paws kind of a bigger than it should be but, hey, you know what? The cat's also wearing sunglasses, so I think inaccuracies and in paw sizes is fine. <coughs> Pause, I'm gonna get up. Holes. It's fine. Shoulders gonna come down here. I'm still trying to get arm proportions good right now, so it kind of looks like his arm's been dislocated. But then he's riding an ox. I don't think he cares, and plus, I think it's supposed to be that way. Because this is a world where a cat can have sunglasses and wield a chainsaw. What does it matter? Nothing matters. Not to Francis von Cadigan and his pal Derp Ox. Francis von Cadigan works for the Milwaukee Brewers Association, fighting the international diamond smuggling ring. And Derp Ox is an ox with brain damage. Together, they're a cat and ox this summer. <laughs> yeah, that is. Francis Bond Cadigan was a regular cat until exposed to ra radiation. Then, through the miracle of radiation, he was given super intelligence and also the ability to stretch his limbs. Now, 
he 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 works with his buddy Dirtbox. They're they're buddies. <laughs> you, you you don't even know how how close of a, a friendship they got. Cause they are they are it's it's they're they're buddies, man. <laughs> Coming this fall on the CW. Dirtbox was a regular ox until a brick hit him in the face, <laughs> which didn't affect him that much because of his thick ox skull. And so he became Dirtbox. Chewing on a halls here. Him and Francis von Cadigan met at a at a convention at at the at the talk at the talk radio convention. Francis von Cadigan loves talk radio. He he drives a lot, you see, and it's it's really a, a lifesaver out on on long, long roads. Cause you get bored. And and what what makes you not bored? Horrible, hate-filled, offensive talk radio. Something you can laugh at and shake your head. Dirtbox's eyes kinda kinda do this thing, like like they have like they're glued to his face. Dirtbox also has an ox face. Yeah. Dirtbox is also rendered immune to all natural diseases because of his his face. Uh, kind of fucked up Dirtbox's hoof. And while I could make the excuse that that's just how Dirtbox's hoof is, I I also have some integrity. I've got some integrity left, damn it. Anyway, they met at a talk radio convention where Dirtbox was said moo and Francis von Cadigan bought him and Durbox said moo it gets a little fuzzy after that get it cuz cuz it's a cat and an ox the ox would have fur, but not like cat fur, like ox fur. And the cat would have cat fur. And there you go. A cat riding an ox, or Francis von Kettigan and his friend, Derp Ox. If you like this video, like, comment, subscribe. If you have anything you want me to draw, list it in the comments below. Uh, and as always, have a good day.